In this demonstration, we're going to take a look at installing OnTime on a new computer. Now this computer needs to be some sort of a Windows-based computer. It can be Windows XP, Windows Vista, or Windows 7 or later. Um, once we get our computer up, we just need to open our web browser. In this case, I'm going to open up Internet Explorer, and I'm going to go to the OnTime website, which is ontimesystem.com. Once I'm there, I'll click on the download link at the top of the page and that will allow me to choose which piece of software I want to download and install. Now if I'm a manager or administrator or the owner of a business I'm going to want to definitely download and install the on-time management suite. However, if I'm installing the software on a ditch dispatcher's computer that only needs limited access to tracking packages and putting orders in I'm going to choose the second program, which is just OnTime Dispatch. Now, the OnTime Dispatch program is bundled in with the OnTime Management Suite program, so if you install OnTime Management Suite, it's somewhat redundant to install the Dispatch program as well, since you'll end up having two copies. So for the sake of this demonstration, I'm just going to go ahead and download OnTime Management Suite. So I'll click that Register to Download button. I'll confirm my information in the uh, registration. Click on this Go to Download uh, button here, and then download the full version. When I do that, it's going to ask me, do I want to run or save the file? Um, usually for uh, successful installations, it's better to go ahead and save the file and then run it directly from your computer. That way you don't have to download it again in the future. So to make it easy for me to find this file after I download it, I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I save it to my desktop. Uh, click Save here. And we'll go ahead and minimize our web browser and wait while the package downloads. Okay, so the file has downloaded to our desktop. We can see the file here. Uh, we can see it is the OnTime logo with a little installation disk there. Um, to install the program, we're just going to now double click on that file. It'll ask us to confirm this. If you're running with higher security settings in Windows Vista or Windows 7, it'll ask you if you want to allow the program to install. So you're going to hit yes or allow to that. I'm um, going to wait for the setup to initialize. And then we'll just follow the wizard from here on out. So we'll go ahead and click next. We'll agree to the terms of the uh, EULA here. We can review that and read it if we like. Go ahead and check that we agree and then click Next. Click Next again and then click Next a final time to go ahead and start the installation process. Now at this point on time will be installed to your computer. Uh, that means that you don't always have to have an internet connection to get up and running with the program. Um, it'll be holding your data and the program directly on your computer. Okay, at this final step, um, we have this checkbox that will automatically start the on-time management suite as soon as we hit finish, so we'll leave that as it is. Click finish, and in just a few moments here, the on-time uh, management program will start up we can go ahead and then sign in with our company ID, username, and password and that will get us into the software. So that's how you install a fresh copy of OnTime Management Suite onto a computer. I hope this has helped. If you have any more questions about installation, uh, please feel free to contact technical support via our website at www.ontimesystem.com. Thank you for your time.